What's going on, guys? It's your boy Maximum RPM coming at you with another video today. And in this video, we got a Super Stadium video. <clears throat> but not just any Super Stadium video. No! No, 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 no. You must be crazy if you think we're doing a regular Super Stadium video. This is going to be a Super Stadium video done North Country Wild. So, in this video, it's going to be a three-way battle between my 3D printed Beyblade, Toxic Rose, 10 Expand Guard, my 3D printed Beyblade, Shatter, the Ultimate Demon Dragon, Triple Hunter Slingshot, and my 3D printed Beyblade. V6. 5 Vortex Friction. This is going to be an epic video. It's going to be a great battle. I can't wait. We've got Shadow the Ultimate Demon Dragon with his incredible attack. V6 with his amazing attack and stamina. And the Wildflower Toxic Rose with its incredible defense and stamina. We're going to get right into it. And before anyone asks, whoa, V8 and V6 do share a special move. They share Redline Rampage. V8 special move is Farmageddon. V6, his special move is Carb Cannon. And a carb is also known as a carburetor. It's what runs older style cars. Toxic Rose, I haven't thought of one yet. Shatters is Dimension Breaker. Let's get right into it. There goes uh, Shatter. V6 got the knockout. Shatter bounced right off of V6. Something tells me Toxic Rose might have this one. So guys, my shop teacher said that he would let me stop by tomorrow because he wants to compare our 3D printers. So I will be printing another Toxic Rose. And I will see if I can uh, talk him into letting me print another V8 here uh, in a couple of weeks. Or maybe next week if I get lucky. I know everyone's probably yelling at me to put uh, V6 on like Extreme or something. I wanted V6 to be a stamina based attack type. Toxic Rose gets one point with that battle. V6 got one point. We're going five, by the way. Got some really good hits. Shatter is running out of stamina. And there he goes. I'm going to have to put Shatter into storm mode. Toxic Rose gets it. The score is two to one to zero. Nice job from the Wildflower. Ooh, Shatter got a big hit on V6. So far, this has been a really good battle. It's coming out of stamina. And the score is 3 to 1. V6 and Shatter are in trouble. They're going to have to work together. And as usual, Shatter's just trying to get the kill on his own. And V6 got that burst, actually, so the score is 3 to 3, yeah. And 
And it's four to three. I put Shatter back into his regular mode. V6 got the burst, so he was at three. That puts him at five points. So V6 has one, but if Toxic Rose gets it, then we will have to go on to a final tiebreaker match between the two of them. Shatter hasn't gotten a single point, so we will leave him out of that. Actually, you know what? We'll throw him in. So V6 and Toxic Rose are now tied in points. Shatter will be in this battle. Tiebreaker round. Oh. Shatter will not be in this battle. Okay. Come on, Shatter. Come apart. I put him together wrong. He only really goes together one way. And that was not it. This might be close. There it goes. And Toxic Rose takes it. That's right, guys. The Wildflower does have its thorns. Shatter is one heck of a Beyblade, but only in close quarters. Notice how his speed looks a lot slower in this stadium. It's not because it's slower, it's because he has more surface area to cover. V6 loses a lot of his power as well because, once again, more surface area to cover. But V6 was able to maintain himself a little bit better in this match. Um, and V6 does actually have some really good defensive capabilities because he took some really big shots from Shatter. Uh, looked like he was actually trying to conceal Toxic Rose from him. Wonder why that could be. But, uh, V6 put in one heck of a fight, but Toxic Rose got the win in the end due to his overwhelming stamina and defense. I gotta say, guys, I am super happy with all three of these Beyblades. Shatter was just kind of a happy accident. Uh, that was literally my first attempt at ever 3D modeling. Um, and I thought it was going to be a piece of garbage, but I wasn't even going to call it Shatter, but it was just how disrespectfully powerful it is. I was like, okay, that earns the name Shatter. And Toxic Rose was me... Uh, fiddling around talking with my buddy Chad and uh, one thing led to another and here this is um, it was actually supposed to be a Beyblade called Flathead Fury the problem is it just looked way too much like a flower and I came up with Toxic Rose as an excuse because there's no way I'm calling a Beyblade that looks like a flower Flathead Fury however that is a plan that I have for the future um, and I know this technically does look more like a daffodil or a daisy I don't know my flowers that well I think it's a daffodil. Yeah, something like that. Um, I know, it looks more like a daffodil than a rose, but toxic rose just sounds cooler than toxic daffodil. Or dangerous daffodil. It's, roses are cool, they're kind of elegant. They're, they got thorns, so. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. Either way, um, toxic rose performs a lot better than I thought it would. Um, I'm actually really interested to see how both V6 and Toxic Rose will go up against V8. And, uh, I dropped a hint to this, but I might as well just say it out loud in this video. There is a new V8 coming to the channel. In fact, there might be two. There's guaranteed one. Uh, so we have the original V8. Then we have Supercharged V8. And now we have Big Block V8. I plan on having a custom driver for that too. 
So someone asked me what the custom driver for V6 is. I won't tell you what it is, but I will tell you the name. And the name of it is Traction. It is custom, it is 3D modeled. Um, when the video is released of it, that's when I will give the creator a shout out. But you guys will just have to stay tuned and wait. It won't be too long before I can get that bad boy printed out. Uh, I might even be able to convince my shop teacher to let me print that out too. Uh, he, he's a pretty, pretty chill guy, so I could probably just come in early one day and get something worked out. But either way, tomorrow I'm going to print off another Toxic Rose. Uh, it might be blue. I don't know. I should, probably should have downloaded the right spin version. No big deal. That's all right. There are two versions too. Toxic Rose. Um. All right, guys. I've been talking longer than I need to. That's about it. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on the bell notification so you get all my videos because I upload daily. And as always, I hope this video makes your day just a little bit better. Live life to the max. Stay awesome.